here to help us taste what awareness feels like and when i taste the awareness i inculcate these habits in my day to day life once it becomes a way of living even if i do not do the breathing exercise let's say for a day or for two days then also i remain mindful and aware because my style of living becomes like that that is the idea behind all this so in this process be very uh, aware and be aware that you do not get attached to any tool that this is my tool or i'm expert in this every awareness has to be there that is the only thing that is that should be the full stop attached to the tool you said ma'am or role tool 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 tool, tool. Okay. yeah Uh, all these things are tools whatever we are doing the uh, mindfulness exercises the walking meditation or eating meditation all these things are tools but tools should not identify us i should not be it should not be like a medicine to a depressing person that till the time he doesn't eat his uh, take his medicine he doesn't feel good it should not happen like that and in that case i am not clinically depressed but maybe i am spiritually depressed that that can happen right so this should not happen us am i able to make sense or did i confuse you? no ma'am completely, completely okay so, uh, can i say that these will not be medicines but uh, they can be immune immunity boosters or vaccinations like right? yes yes they are like that and they help us to lead a path of a mindful living and when when this becomes my way of living i do not need any tool because when i become aware i am the awareness then there is no tool which will actually help me though i will be doing them i'll be doing them the yoga uh, the dance is a good meditation technique uh, the dance the uh, painting knitting whatever we do with full attention is meditation for us everything we will be doing it but our awareness will not be dependent on that as far as this session was concerned uh, visualization is still a barrier for me but your voice uh, you know it guides us so nicely to the flow and that was very nice like doing it by self will be very difficult as such a come i'm rightly said but uh, the way you guide us the way your voice guides us it's amazing i didn't want you to stop uh, so Thank yeah you. i just wanted to to continue continue and uh, i actually uh, said thanks and i said sorry also to them oh, for wow. behaving yeah because i have behaved very rudely with them like for so many years mm-hmm. and have ill ill treated them and i feel that's why they are giving me all these uh, you know health issues true yeah so yes, I, you're right I, I think, yeah i have really said sorry to them i have wonderful brain ko bhi maine ye kiya ki why did you behave like this now i'm going to train and guide you first i said i'll control you but then i said no i'll mm. guide ha yes so, because then they become our friend yeah and then for that like that activity is your you really nice to give in gratitude like for so many years for last like 30 years of my life i've not thanked my brain so mm. i mean my all the body parts and for that it's like a wonderful experience so thank you you know completely thank you for thank you for uh, doing it so uh, beautifully and you know immersing into it thank you for that and i think that there is one reason though i will be sharing that what are the things that we should be doing as a practitioner so that you know the same energy is transferred to our participants also uh, one reason that i would like to share right now is that maybe it was uh, effective because i was also doing it with you all 